Hello and welcome to a Kingon electric vehicles conversion update. This time we are introducing you to our next conversion which is a 1968 Morris Minor Traveller. Um, here you can see it in our showroom. It's actually come to us already stripped of a lot of its components so that we can get straight on with the conversion. The plan with this one is to give it a leaf motor and um, six, sorry, 12, 16 of 30 kilowatt hour modules, so giving it around about 20 kilowatt hours of, of battery storage. So you can see it doesn't need us to do anything restoration wise and it actually came to us without the motor in. So we've got able to kind of get straight on with doing things and because we've done one before we've already mocked up some of the stuff there's the motor one of the charges and some of the battery boxes and we've put in the motor adapter plate so here we can see this in a little bit more detail um, we've actually had to move the the battery boost sorry not the battery the brake booster on the left hand side of the engine bay there just a few inches because it was interfering with where the support for the front battery box wanted to go you can see that's our aluminium um, adapter plate between the leaf motor and the original Morris Minor gearbox. And you can see there that that's where the 6.6 .6 kilowatt charge is going to sit, just up in where the, the battery used to sit. All the bracketry is getting made for that at the moment. And inside, what we've done is we've taken the original um, heater matrix out, the water-based heater matrix, and we've replaced it with a PTC, 3 kilowatt PTC heater. So that's all in the original case. And to uh, use as much of the original car as we can do and it's all bolt in bolt out as well and then in the back we've then mocked up the rear battery box which will hold 12 of those um, 30 kilowatt hour leaf modules um, so that's the, the layout and then as well as the modules being in the rear we also install on those supports that you've just seen um, a front battery box this is the new design that we have for the, the six modules at the front and also to contain the contactors and all the, the control um, hardware and service plugs and everything in the front. So that's it mocked up into its position just to make sure that everything's fitting in the right way and all the other component will fit around it. So that's our next port of call is just to start making the bracketry and, and actually put the motor in just to make sure that everything fits in exactly the right way that it needs to. Because the car came to us without its engine and without, we didn't know the exact weights on it because we've not actually done a traveller before, we've done a convertible. We borrowed a, a lovely traveller from a, a friend of ours and we used our um, scales to be able to weigh it so that we could see what the, the weight was both front and rear and left to right so we can either improve that or replicate it and make sure that we're uh, putting the weight in the right places. Here you can see the car actually sat on the scales, basically just jacked up and lowered onto the scales so and it's in, in the right place. And what we found was, as we come around, you'll see the actual numbers on the scales. It, it's quite balanced, 488 pounds on the rear and 422, 415 on the front. So that's where we are with this one at the moment. A bit more planning to do and we'll keep you up to date in upcoming videos. So subscribe and keep an eye on what we're doing.